This is Andrea, and I'm going to be doing a review of Amazon Basics single monitor mounting arm. And there it is pictured with the booklet that comes with it. Quite extensive. Really like the directions they've given me for this. Here's the base that you attach either by using this clamp or you can do it um, with a screw. Um, they show two different methods to do this. The articulating arm and then the actual mount that goes on the back of your monitor or HDTV. Uh, it's got both the 75 and the 100 millimeter holes which is great so it makes it a little bit more versatile and uh, very well made. Now one of my favorite parts I have to say is how they've packaged all the parts, even a cable tie and they label it. I've never seen, uh, to the best of my knowledge, in pretty much anything lately just so well thought out in terms of packaging. Really good job, Amazon. Here I'm on step three, and I found it a little bit confusing trying to figure out how to orient the arm onto the back of the monitor. But I did figure it out, and here it has. Uh, have it on there. And I have, over here, attached it to my desk. So going on to step quite four. possibly is the easiest part. The middle part, the little arm, uh, is plastic. And then the bracket cover, which is shown here, is actually right here. And here we have the arm attached to the base. the one problem you may run into. You notice my desk is really close to the wall. Well, that arm cannot go anywhere. It has no play. So you may want to mount this on the side of your desk just so that you have more play. Because otherwise, in my case, <laughs> I don't even know if I can pan on back, back far enough. It's almost like right in my lap. Um, that does pull out and I'll have some some distance with that. And you do have other adjustments, but just so you're aware, where that's a fairly significant arm, and it does kick back uh, to accommodate different positions. So here I have the arm mounted to the right-hand side of my desk, so I can use one monitor in portrait mode, where I use the other one on the desktop in landscape mode. This for me works really well uh, when I'm writing, because I can use one monitor as either for email or a point of reference for whatever I'm writing. Uh, really happy with the way this anchored to a relatively thin desk. It's very substantial, weighs quite a bit, so I was a little worried about it would be too heavy, but actually um, the monitor is only 12 pounds, and it can take up to 25 pounds on the end of that arm. And after moving it around, it's really substantial. I wouldn't worry about it at all. Um, as long as you have secured your uh, monitor or your TV really well with this mount, the included screws went right into that one. I tried it on three different monitors, had no issues. The housing part, this top part, has cable management, but the way that my cables are, I couldn't quite use that. I have to get some longer cables. I look forward to neatening that up in the future. There's only one real plastic part, and that's this part of the arm. And it doesn't, I thought, I was a little concerned because it wasn't metal and the other parts were, but really when it's being used, you don't even notice anything like that, and it all seems very stable. Very happy with it. Happy with the build quality, happy with how it is anchored, uh, happy with the way I can move that either to portrait or landscape mode, in and out. The only thing that I would t say take note of is this part is up against the wall for me, and it would be ideal for like a corner desk where you could move that arm around um, in certain s configurations, like when I had this closer to the center of the desk, it would hit the wall in a way that didn't work for me. So, just something to be aware of, but overall, excellent build quality, would have no reservations recommending it to others, and I think most people will find this really versatile. If you have any comments or questions, leave them for me. I'll do my best to answer them. Thanks for watching the video.